That's the sound of your current hype level at the gas pump. But brace yourself for something fuel nominal, because Unleaded 88 is about to take the hype to a whole new level. Unleaded 88 is cheaper, cleaner, and greener than regular Unleaded. Plus, it's homegrown, making Unleaded 88 the clear choice at the pump and totally worth the hype. So pump it up with Unleaded 88, brought to you by Iowa Corn. Welcome to July 27th on the National Day Calendar. Today we're toasting to a distinguished drink and celebrating a state with a storied past. Is your vehicle stopping like it should? Does it squeal or grind when you brake? Don't miss out on summer brake deals at O'Reilly Auto Parts. Oh, 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 O'Reilly Auto Parts. First up, it's National Scotch Day. Scotch whiskey, often simply called Scotch, has a rich history that ties deeply with the culture of Scotland. But here's something you might not know. Scotch whiskey was initially considered illegal. In 1644, the Scottish Parliament imposed a tax on whiskey production, leading many distillers to go underground. It wasn't until 1823, with the Excise Act, that Scotch whiskey was officially recognized and taxed, paving the way for the industry to flourish. Today, scotch is enjoyed worldwide and governed by strict regulations to ensure its authenticity. So, the next time you sip a glass of scotch, remember, it's a drink that fought to survive. I love scotch. I love scotch. Scotch is got scotch. Here it goes down. All right, two glasses, two large cubes of ice. Topping that off now with a little bit of my favorite scotch. And here you go, Latoya. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, my gosh. (laughs) (laughs) You know, it's an acquired taste to some. That's all I can say. From the highlands of Scotland, we move to the shores of America with National New Jersey Day. New Jersey, one of the original 13 colonies, boasts a variety of firsts, from the first organized baseball game to the first boardwalk in Atlantic City. But did you know that New Jersey was the site of a pivotal moment in aviation history? In 1910, the first successful passenger flight in the United States took off from Atlantic City. Glenn Curtis, a pioneer aviator, piloted his groundbreaking flight, changing the course of travel forever. So today, as you think about New Jersey, remember it's not just the Garden State. It's a state that has helped shape the world as we know it. I've never been to New Jersey. Well, I think next year for New Jersey Day, we should do our show there. I think that's a great idea, but how about we go there today and celebrate? I, Come on, Marlo. Uh, my goodness, it's a little time to get there, but maybe. Let's talk about it. Okay, I'm Latoya Johnson. I'm Marlo Anderson. Thank you for joining us on our journey to celebrate every day. Till next time, keep celebrating. <laughs>